<laughs> Fellas, G Man, Still City RC. Beautiful day in Pittsburgh. We got sun shining. Um, nice day to do some RC. I'm at my. Uh, this is my one of my typical spots I go to. I'm um, running a couple fifth scales today. Got the low CMTXL with the Taylor 35cc engine in it. Um, I just got that installed, so I just wanted to give it a rip. I got two tanks of fuel through it already, so it's ready to be leaned out a little more and broke in. You know, it's pretty much broke in, but it needs the final. So today will be the day. I'm going to go ahead and get it fueled up. I'll give you guys a quick look at it, but that's that park. I, I come here quite frequently. It looks like they took a lot of my jumps away that were right here. All the fun's gone now. <laughs> But we still got the hill climb. That rock hill might be kind of fun for like an X-Max or something. But there used to be bigger jumps right over here and stuff. But it's kind of fun because you can rip through here. Get your top speed. You know, you can get some pretty good speed right there. So, All right, further ado, let's take a look at the Losey. I got the, um, that is the Detroit Performance's uh, black, what do they call that? Black, the Black Diamond Edition. Where they actually just milled off some of the anodizing. Um, but yeah, 35cc fitting there really nicely. Uh, got the Olamat pipe on there. I love that pipe, it's great. Um, I put a three finger tur uh, turtle racing handle on the pull starter. Make it a little easier to pull because this little sucker got some compression. But uh, let's spin it around. So yeah, In front view. You have to get out of your full force brass inserts into the low C tank. Turtle racing air filter re relocator. Um, so this piston port, man, this thing runs really well in here. <laughs> I was surprised. It's as big and heavy as this truck is. I weighed this thing at 43 pounds last time I checked it. Because I got fast lane machine um, extended aluminum arms and FID diffs in there. Uh, there's actually aluminum diff cups in there too. So, I don't know, I'm excited. Let's give it a rip. I'm going to fuel it up. Um, once I get her fueled up, we'll uh, get back to you. All right, fellas, we got it fired up. Got the body on it. This thing's ripping. <laughs> it really is. <laughs> How's that loud, too? Good God. <laughs> man Oh, 
Wow. Piston Ford Power, baby. Look at them revs, guys. I'm digging it, man. isn't it? <laughs> I love it. People probably wondering how it'll do on the grass. Well, here we go. That's some high grass, too. This ain't been cut in a while. All right. 
right, guys. I'm gonna let it cool off a little bit. I think I got the tone pretty much on. <laughs> Listen to that thing. Love it. Yeah, we'll let her cool down a little bit. Taylor 35 in a low CMTXL, guys. I think it's doing quite well, man. I don't know. What do you guys think? I, just, you know, I think the 35 is a good fit for this truck. You know, I wasn't sure it did well. It did really well. Very happy with it. Alright guys, well for another episode we're going to be probably take it somewhere uh, off road, get some jumps in and stuff like that. Maybe even put a GPS on and see how fast it goes. Alright guys, I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you.